part one. Monta se click first from part one. Part one interview. What is your full name? Yeah, my full name is Monta Samson. Please come and that's my nickname. And the next question is, may I see your ID? Here yeah, can see this is my ID. This is my school ID card. Here is written my name, my father's name, my mother's name, and my school ID. Which from I reading, which class I reading, and my school role That's and it. many things. That's it. Now listen to me. Uh, yeah, when we will answer this question, uh, just say uh, yes. Here you are. Yes. Here you are. That's enough. Okay. Okay, sir. Or here it is, or here it is. Write down this uh, two sentence. Here you are, or here it is. Here it is, it's better for you. Here it is. Okay, okay. okay go ahead. You can see here it is. Here is written my name, my father's name, my mother's name, and my school role, my which class I read, and many things. And the next question is, where are you from? Yeah, I'm from Bogra. Bogra is under Russia division. You know, Bogra is famous for its yogurt and Mohsengar. You know, guys, Bogra yogurt is very tasty and Bogra Mohsengar is a historical place. Do you work or study? Actually, I'm a student. Obviously, I'm studying. What kinds of advertisement? What kinds of advertisements do you dislike? I don't like. What can I do? I don't like any ads. What kinds of advertisements do you watch? I was like cartoon advertis. Where can you see advertisements? I was advertisements in TV. So I have done. Uh, yeah, Montasir, only one mistake that I should mention for you. Um, that is, I am study, not I am study. You have to say I study. Okay, obviously I study, or of course I study. Uh, okay, uh, Montasir, now you can describe part two. So I can see part two. I think it's visible. Why can't you see? Describe an important river or lake in your country. Can't you see? Sir, I can see the first line on Okay, okay, I'm going to do I'm going to share it again uh, only for you. I think it's visible now. Yes, and now I can see it. Okay. Start with play. Part two. Describe an important river in your country. Please tell me. Yeah. The important uh, why it is located. It is located in Dhaka. It's, it is, its name is Yamuna's River. It is a big river. How big long it is. It is very big river. What it looks like? It looks like very big. And I, when I go to Taka, when I see this river, explain why it is important. How can I explain it's important? No, what can I tell? Uh, Second tail. Yeah, uh, Montasir, you can describe part three also if you like. So I have to revision part three. Uh, okay, no problem. No problem. I'm going to another one. Uh, ready then? Uh, Salman, Salman, please unmute yourself and describe part three. Salman Al Hassan. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hello, sir. So I try to give the answer part three. 
Okay, but Jirim, first question, how can river lake benefit uh, local people? Uh, definitely, I th th think um, lake or river uh, also both uh, important for, or for the local people to cultivate and uh, to uh, hunting many types of fish. Um, I think um, river is uh, um, very important to uh, why, um, to uh, decorate a city or town uh, because uh, in my hometown uh, i noticed that a river is uh, um, a very uh, big uh, big river and many uh, both uh, boats uh, uh, running uh, on the river uh, by uh, to, by transporting many uh, types of food one place to another place and uh, many people uh, uh, cross the river by boat. Uh, uh, so, so I think it is very uh, enjoyable and uh, uh, many uh, the farmer uh, is uh, benefited by uh, using uh, water of this river uh, for cultivating uh, cultivation, many types of uh, uh, vegetables and plants on their fields. Uh, yeah. Next, uh, do you think uh, rivers or lakes attract tourists? Uh, actually, I should mention is that uh, river and uh, lakes uh, both uh, attracted, uh, uh, both are attracted uh, for, for the tourists and uh, many um, foreign tourists uh, visited um, in our uh, river, in our city, uh, that's, uh, situated, that's situated in my hometown, uh, and they are very attracted to eat many types of fish uh, from the river, uh, from the, the river uh, restaurants and um, and they are attracted uh, um, beside area of river uh, uh, to go uh, to visit there and uh, also they are uh, also there uh, noticed on many types of uh, birds uh, especially uh, winter in the winter season many foreign birds uh, visited in our lakes uh, or, or in our rivers. Uh, uh, so, uh, and that times uh, uh, and that times uh, many visited uh, many tourists uh, visited in their in this uh, area and uh, our government uh, can uh, benefited uh, uh, for, for economic for developing economic uh, yeah next uh, how do rivers lake or uh, affect local tourism uh, I think uh, in, uh, tourism are uh, affected uh, um, by river area, uh, especially uh, local tourism uh, when they are visited in uh, this in Shitlok uh, rivers. Uh, they are attracted uh, many types of uh, food and many types of uh, birds and animals. Uh, also, uh, small mountains uh, situated in beside the river. Uh, so, so, they are uh, very attracted in this uh, types of mountains and uh, the in, and from this uh, river when they are crossing or uh, the river, they, are very, they can enjoy a lot uh, from by by boat and uh, launch. Uh, and they can easily uh, travel to one place to another place uh, uh, by using this river. Okay, next question. Uh, 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 how river lake suitable for transport and why? Uh, okay, I think uh, the river is uh, suitable for uh, transport uh, because uh, uh, when, uh, because in the uh, because uh, when the uh, farmer uh, try to uh, tra transport their food or uh, or marketing things uh, uh, one place to another place they use many types of boat and uh, lawns. Uh, uh, especially, I think uh, boat is uh, is suitable for uh, for, for environment uh, because. Uh, in the road area, many vehicles uh, uh, vehicles is uh, responsible for uh, for color for polluted uh, air polluted uh, for for so for that reason, uh, I think river is uh, suitable for uh, transport, especially boat is very important and uh, and it is very um, anti polluted uh, vehicles. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Salman, for your space. I think you are repeating your mannerism several times. It's overcoming. Try to uh, listen to your own words. Okay, then. Yeah, yes, sir. Okay. 
able to carry out your own mistakes. What type of mistakes do you commit uh, while delivering your space? Okay, sir. Okay, Salman, thank you very much for your time. Okay, sir, assalamualaikum. There's a matter of grace. Uh, okay, Muntasir, uh, please unmute yourself. You have to speak right now. So can you hear me? Yeah, your sound is clear to us. So part three discussion. How can reverse less benefit local people? Uh, reverse local people benefits reverse many things like uh, features, cash fees, and there are money to and. And uh, so once again, let's start. Keep both the device at a distant place. Otherwise, so I have, so I have network problem. No, no. Uh, you must keep your mobile far from your laptop. If you do it, then it will be okay. Now it's okay, Muntasi. Go ahead. Okay, sir. Part three discussion. How can weavers or legs benefit local people? Local people get many, many benefits to reverse or legs. Like features, cash, fees and they uh, sell the fishes in markets and they earn money and these benefits local people get from rivers. The next question is do you think rivers or lakes attract tourists? Yes, obviously I think uh, rivers or lakes attract to tourists. How the next question is how to reverse legs affect to local tourism? Uh, reverse or legs affect local tourism like many things, like they earn money from tourist uh, tourism. And the next question is are rivers or legs suitable for transport? Why? Obviously, I think rivers are less suitable for transport. That's all, sir. Uh, okay, uh, thank you very much for your space. You have done well. Uh, so, of course, you, you will take your question properly uh, before delivering your space. That will help you to improve yourself very first. Okay. Uh, okay, sir. Then, Assalamualaikum, sir. Uh, Adam, Adam. Please, uh, I would like to share your space. One any part, part one, part two, or part three. Maybe this is your first day or not. Are you new here, Adam? Yeah, hello, how are you? Can you hear me? Yeah, your sound is clear to us. Yeah, it's my first time to join the Zoom uh, meeting. So, uh, part one interview. Oh, wow. Okay, so the first one, what is your full name? My full name is Adam Yin. So what 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 we are, are we going to do here? Yeah yeah, go through the go through the question yourself and answer it, and I will find out your mistakes. Okay, so may I see your ID? Yes, please. Where are you from? I'm from China. Do you work or study? I work as a, a volunteer in non governmental organization. What kinds of advice, uh, advertisements do you dislike? Uh, the advertisements I don't like are fake advertisements. Do you share advertisements with others? Yeah, sometimes. Uh, if I I bought some useful products from the real advertisement, I will share the experience with my friends and people around me. What kinds of advertisements do you watch? Oh, oh. 
all kinds of advertisements on the television. I cannot, you know, avoid of uh, watching them. Where can you see advertisements? Television, uh, radio, uh, websites, apps, and sometimes, you know, outdoors everywhere. Should I continue? Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Go ahead. Okay, part part two, Q card. Describe an important river lake in your country. Please tell me where it is located, how big, long it is, what it looks like, explain why it is uh, important. Uh, uh, there is a river which name is Songhua River uh, around in my city and it's located in the north part of the north northeastern part of China which uh, where the city name is um, Songyuan and uh, how big is it it's uh, a long river it's a uh, long river you know around the city and it looks like um, a dragon. Uh, because you know the river em em embraces the city, and the river looks like a, a flying dragon. It is very important because you know our city, our water from the river, and then you know the river can uh, give us the water for the vegetables, all kinds of plants, and then good for our environment and for our climate. Uh, discussion, how can rivers, lakes benefit local people? Uh, rivers, lakes, you know, brings lots of benefits for local people because, you know, it can change the climate and then you can feel the humid, humid, humid you know, humidity from the river. And then you know, uh, because the you you also can get the a big amount of fresh water from the river, and then um, you also sometimes you know if you go for walking around the river, it's good for your health, for your body. Do you think rivers like uh, attract tourists? Mm, if the river located in big cities, developed cities such as in uh, Shanghai, this is a big city and they have a river there, uh, that will attract a tourist. But you know, if the river located in a small city or a very distant, you know, area, or you know, if the river located in a not very famous city, not big city, I don't think it attracts tourists. How do river lakes affect local tourism? Mm, as what I said about, if the river is um, the biggest or has something you know special, it will attract uh, affect you know local tourism and attract some tourists. But if the river just in you know, the normal river, not big enough and not located in a big city or a developed city or you know doesn't have anything special, just a river with water. I don't think, you know, it uh, will affect local tourism too much. Are rivers like suitable for transport? Why? Um, if, no, no, you know, in, uh, if, you know, the public transportation in the city uh, it's really good, su such as there are lots of buses, taxis, cars, and they have good roads, railways, and the airports. I don't think the, uh, they, they, they can use the river too much for transport. But as I said, if the river is really big and connected with the other very big, you know, uh, ports or some other places, and you can import import some products from the, the, the river. I think it will suitable suitable for transport. But if the river is a small one and it's not a very important, it just you know the inside the city, and then you know I don't think you know it's good. 
uh, to use it for transport. And anything else? Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> thank you very much for your space. Actually, uh, without taking preparation to speak like this way, and this is also a new platform for you today. Uh, I think you have done well, uh, very well. Uh, but the fact is that sometimes it seems to me that you are mixing your local accent with your English. Uh, so try to overcome it. Uh, if you can overcome it, I think your space will be more attractive to us. Uh, okay, Adam, is it clear to you? Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, you can join with us again if you like on Tuesday at the same time. Okay, thank you. Because you know here is uh, uh the, the afternoon on Sunday, Sunday afternoon here. Yeah, yeah. Uh today today is Sunday and uh, our next class will be one uh Tuesday, then Thursday okay. three days in a week. Okay. And before okay, I, okay. I share this topic in our all groups or from where you have uh, got the link, of course you will get uh, the uh -huh. on uh, Tuesday before uh, at least two hours or sometimes uh, one and 30 uh, the minutes before our class, you will get the link. Okay. 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 Yeah, because you know that I just opened the uh, WhatsApp group and I've read the what you sent uh, in the group and I just joined it. Uh, Thank you. WhatsApp group. Uh, from where have you got the link? Pardon? Uh, from where have you got the link? Zoom link. Huh? From where have you got it? The link. My name. The class link. From where have you got it? Uh, you mean currently where do I stay? The country. Okay. Uh, I didn't get you, sorry. <laughs> uh, okay, okay. Uh, and I'm, uh, actually, we have some uh, WhatsApp group and a messenger group. I don't know uh, in which group you belong to. Uh, you will get all the information from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm in the WhatsApp group and some people, they share some information materials in the WhatsApp group. Yeah, I read it sometimes. Uh, okay, Adam, thank you very much for your speech and for your- Thank you. Uh, thank you very much for your post. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, dear participants, this is the end of our today's class. And thank you for your participation. Good night. Uh, good night, thank you.